thank you everybody for coming to this very important press conference that we're having here at the Paleo Vista South High School. This is our first ever dedication of any room at the Paleo Vista South. So I'd like to, to for you to see the Dan Hogan, Tennessee Bob LeBlanc PE storage room. Dan Hogan was the longtime softball coach, PE department chair here, the all-time winningest softball coach in the history of the Paleo Vista South. And Tennessee Bob LeBlanc was our first ever director of Titan Transportation and just an all-around good dude. So we're very excited about the dedication of this PE store room. We'll just give you a quick look on the inside. Come on, take a look. Woo! Good job, Grandpa! And now I'll open it up for any questions. Yes? Why did you call Dan Stan? Interesting that you asked that question. Well, Coach Olson, our football coach, named, thought Dan's name was Stan, and for some reason Dan never corrected him. So he went from Stan, Dan to Stan. And some of us that have known him a long time really think Stan fits better than Dan. <laughs> yes? What did Dan mean to the school? Well, Dan meant an awful lot to the school. He sent all staff emails, and for some reason he put S-T-A-P-H. Uh, he was obviously our first <laughs> department chair, and I don't know that he, um, I don't know if he actually knew every staff member, <laughs> but he tried to get to know everybody. And, um, he went to a lot of games and did a lot of things around school. Yes? Do you think Dan actually shrunk as he <clears throat> aged? Physically? Oh, I absolutely. <laughs> and he brought a scrapbook to school one time to prove how, how good and big he was at one point. What was your fondest memory? Well, my fondest memory of Tennessee Titan Bob LeBlanc is state volleyball in Grand Island. He drove the girls down, we stayed overnight, and he and I uh, had to go out and get food for the girls. And um, he really, that, that state championship volleyball team, he really liked those girls and they liked him. Uh, my fondest memory of Dan. Oh, that's a, that's a hard one. Um, I won't tell the, I'm, I'm not gonna tell the aerobic story. Um, I think the very first district softball championship we ever won, we went to state, it was in Fremont, and I, I'm in the, I'm watching, and he walks over after the game, he's not wearing any Titan gear at all, and he's wearing purple, he was very fond of wind pants. Dan wore a lot of different shades of wind pants. And he came over and he said, you know, the strangest thing about this, I haven't eaten all day and I'm not hungry. <laughs> and we had just qualified first time to go to state. Yes? Did Dan ever beat Coach Lamb at one-on-one -on -one basketball? Absolutely never. No, nine, I think nine straight times they got beat. I'll take one more question and we're gonna have to go. Yes? Multiple choice question. What kind of hitter was Dan in softball? A power hitter or a punch and Judy? Oh, definitely Dan was a punch and Judy. <laughs> definitely, definitely. And I would tell you, you know, uh, Tennessee Titan Bob LeBlanc, we had well over a thousand activity trips with zero accidents. So safety was his middle name. We knew how to get to every high school every, year, every, every which way. And, and uh, so both those guys obviously are very important parts of the Paleo Vista South history. So thank you for coming and obviously take a look at maybe those pictures of those guys. You'll see Coach Lineham in a picture with Tennessee Bob LeBlanc. We also call him Tennessee Titan Bob. All right, have a good day. Go Tiger, Bob. See you later.